Hi, welcome to this um, system, and it's actually Alkalix B XFC minimal version. And there's a question of a user about caffeine, and I've just updated my machine, so that's included as well. So PKS YUA is what I've done, and update is what I've done. Now, if anything is written into your ETC scale, then you type as well scale. And that's it. You are now have the latest version of uh, Arch Linux. So it says 18.10.4. I can easily change it to the correct version. ETC LSB release. This is actually now today version 11. And you save it. And next time you open up the terminal it will say that you have version 18.11.2. So it is not that difficult to keep rolling to update your system. There's a complete article that I've written on Linux B Plasma, where there are three procedures you could try out, but basically it's just update and make sure that the scale is, to you, is copied to your home directory. Now, like I said, it's about caffeine, right? So I wanna help a user with problems with caffeine. What is caffeine? It's an application to never really shut down your computer, so you keep it awake. Like caffeine, it does just the same, right? Prevents the desktop becoming idle in full screen mode, that's one thing. And there's another one, I don't know what this one is, so let's just investigate both of them. So my best guess is, I think, yeah, plus six people here plus 96 people here so probably this is going to be the one that people voted for and want and, and appreciate so I'm gonna install first ng and let's see what this is I'm doing this with uh, yay could have done it with uh, Trison it just well a choice it's just an AOR helper and you make your decision what you choose so caffeine is installed as I'm going to look for it. Caffeine NG temporarily deactivate the screen saver and sleep mode. So this coffee is here, coffee jar, and you click on it. Now it's active. Now it's not active. Now it's active, right? So we have enabled caffeine preferences. You can check out that as well. Show tray icon, show notification on startup, and that's basically the only thing we really can do with it. I mean. It's just simple, it's on or off, right? So it was um, that application, I guess this is the real thing. So I'm wondering what the other one is. Don't need probably this one, number five. I'm gonna install it anyway. And then it says installing caffeine will remove caffeine NG. So this is tray thingy. So basically we're good, everything works. We don't need the other one. So my guess is, I don't know what the problem of the user is, but caffeine does seem to work here. And if I would, I'm gonna do that, I'm gonna leave my computer as is, and it should not go to sleep, it should keep awake because of the caffeine. All right, um, I hope that's an instructive video. If you did not hear about caffeine, well, there's a big tip in it for you and uh, enjoy our clinics, all right?